We want to continue this hour by going live to the White House, where One America's Neil W. McCabe, he has the latest on the president's Michigan rally and fallout from the White House Correspondents' Dinner. Hi there, Neil. You attended last night's party. How was the event there in D.C.? Well, it was fun to uh, sit with the One American, uh, One American News colleagues at our table, but Michelle Wolf was the uh, entertainment and it really didn't go down well. She really didn't uh, read the mood of the room or Washington. I think what's happening now that we're coming into the second year of the Trump administration, people are realizing that there, there is going to be no impeachment. There's going to be no indictment. He's going to be here for the long haul. And Washington sort of settling, settling in to that. And Michelle Wolf just completely misread that mood, Rachel. And Neil, we're seeing a lot of backlash. Tell us a little bit more about last night's host. Yeah, <clears throat> what they tried to do last night is uh, do a reset, focus on uh, the First Amendment, focus on industry awards and the scholarships. But Michelle Wolf really, uh, really was mean and nasty. She made some very uh, rude comments about uh, Sarah Sanders and uh, Kellyanne Conway. Uh, she referred to her own uh, porn star name as Reince Priebus. And uh, I guess in rehearsal, those jokes were supposed to, it must have gone over well, but it absolutely bombed last night, Rachel. So, Neil, the dinner sounds like it was not as exciting as the Trump rally. How did the president do in Michigan? Well, you know, the, uh, the Trump rally was... Uh, absolutely packed out. Uh, the president spoke about a lot of things. One of them they talked about was uh, the negotiations uh, about the Korean Peninsula. Here's what he had to say about the Korean Peninsula last night. Remember they were saying, he's going to get us into nuclear war, they said. Nuclear. No, no, no. Strength is going to keep us out of nuclear war. Not going to get us in. <clears throat> so the the president was in Michigan, and that really wasn't an accident. There are 10 Democrats up for re-election in the Senate this year in states that were won by Trump. Michigan is one of them. And I'm sure that uh, Senator Debbie Stabenow, who's the uh, incumbent up for re-election in Michigan, would have preferred that Trump went to the dinner instead of campaigning in her backyard, Rachel. All right, One America's Neil W. McCabe reporting from the White House. Thank you so much, Neil, for that live report. We can use your help. Call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call today.